All right. Welcome, welcome everyone. So this one is last match of today in the group stage for Maverick Cup and we have TWOB versus Try Gaming. I know many of you were waiting for this match. Tayap coming in here. He will go be using Queen Charge Lalo against Yoyo. Alright, we will be queen charging from that 3 o'clock corner where we are also deploying the flame flinger. We are just waiting for the air defense to go down before we start with the wounds and of course sending the Kokolun just in case if there is any seeking air mine. Sending the bunch of super wall breakers giving more access for the queen so she can reach right now, scatter shot, but start uh, moving to this compartment here. If the king will be nicely funneling the left side, the queen shouldn't walk at all. We still have one more super wall breaker. Come on, queen, go to the right side. That's where we want you. There we go. Sending another cocoon and look at that wall breaker. If you get this wall open, queen can reach all three infernos. Eagle, there is also the raid spell tower. That queen charge value is amazing. All right, invisibility spell on the queen right now. Only the problem is that the sweeper will be keep pushing the healers away. So not gonna uh, healing the queen properly. You can see power of the rage uh, spell tower and the inferno. The healers are almost gone. Now we are laloning. We are freezing around the town hall. Queen is on the third inferno. So all three infernos are gone here. Loons over the town hall. Warden is so far away. Here we go. Warden ability here. We still have enemy clean up, but the headhunters are on the way to help her. Flame flinger still keep going. Still have royal champion, which is deploying right now. Freezing around the scatter shot and also the wizard tower. Loons are over the monolith. Can they clear the monolith? That is very important. There we go. Royal champion clearing the X bomb. Ars is stunning the cannon, deploying the rest of the loons. Now what we have? Rocket balloons and the yet is coming out. The rocket balloon uh, pulling some of the air trap. As you can snipe these defenses with the shield. Boom, boom, boom. And guys, tie up hitting the first three star for TWOB. Nicely done from him. Nice queen charge. I like it. That queen charge was OP. Got the queen inside this compartment, clearing three infernos. Eagle, raid spell power. That's very nice value. And it is first triple for them. I have to check, but I think so. Maybe we are opening the Nada slot for the emote. That would be really cool. Guys, we are live with the first hit for try. Nebras is in. And we will be using the dragons with the kill squad because we have Golem. But right now, just using that queen for the funnel. We will be sending the. Uh, uh, we have Blim on the way, okay, using the wooden ability here. He will be cloning probably super minions. And now we are deploying the golem to pick up this uh, ground expo. And here we go, cloning the super minions. Dragons are cleaning the multi inferno in the core of the base. We got the town hall invisibility spell perfect on the super minions, clearing the monolith. All right, we have some of the uh, dragons. Uh, going for the archer tower because queen a little bit behind so the funnel isn't set up perfectly here now taking some damage from this multi still have a big part of the base which we need to clear but plenty of spells one dragon going on his own to fight the enemy RC with the poison, slowing down the RC. But the dragon not fighting back. Now he's fighting back and he cleared the enemy royal champion. He did. Some of the seeking air mines. Didn't kill the dragons. Tornado trap being triggered. Not a seeking air mine there. You call it two star? I don't think so. Are you sure? I see with the shield. Boom, boom, boom. Single inferno is issue. But we have three spells and also invisibility spell. I think he can still clutch it here, guys. Because it, look at this. Uh, Dig is stunning the single inferno. We probably gonna find some uh, skellies here. 
Okay, the Royal Champion quite low health. Come on, RC. Invisibility spell, I think so. Definitely worth it. Oh, rip the wood and hitting the seeking air mine. Phoenix and the Royal Champion clearing the scatter shot, but now we have to fight all these skellies here. 40 seconds left. Gonna be close one. Not gonna lie. The storage is full HP. Coming in here with the Queen ability. He knows time is ticking. Diggy still up. Come on, Diggy. Oh, triggering the giant bomb. Rip our archers. Rip our Diggy. It is defense. It is hold. That queen is taking way too much damage. We needed to keep the uh, Diggy alive. Nice try from Nebras, but zoom it. With the defense here, 94% two star. Very nice try. This time Goyle is in, so we will see some Inferno Dragons. We do. We are bringing a 19 Sneakies. So he will try to clear the town hall with them. Every time someone uh, uses the Queen ability, giant bombs appear immediately to kill the archers. Yeah. This is unlucky. Okay, so he needs to clear all this building before the sneakies can go for the town hall. Why we are doing that, what we are doing next, just using the yeti, we clear uh, air defense, okay, with the yeti mines, still need uh, elixir collector, and of course check for the traps. <clears throat> Alright, here we go. Big group of the sneaky is on the way, he going heavy with the sneaky so he doesn't have to use the... Invisibility spell. Okay. Interesting choice there. Now, we have still that air defense up on this side, so we are using the Dragon Rider. We know Dragon Rider first target is always defense. And starting with the rest of the dragons. Using the uh, free spell over the monolith here. We hit a tornado trap. Now we are raging and also using the wooden ability here. So what he will try to blimp uh, around that eagle here. That's where we want to pop the blimp. Hello blimp. Oh maybe not. Oh. Oh no we are swagging the clone spell. Oh he wanted scatter shots. But the loon. Oh my. This is not going well for uh, Gohiel. We just swagged the clone spell. That's huge. Like he wanted, okay, he wanted scatter shots, but the blimp didn't make it. When the uh, blimp popped, the loons went towards the eagle and still were far away. And that's the big rip here. It will be hold for the regress. And also the issue is that clan castle is there. So the real champion, even that she is trying to clear some defenses, she will be locked on the lava. And this is going to be low percent. Swag two clone spells. Mm. It was greedy. I thought that he going here. I didn't even uh, look at the scatter shots. Very nice try. Very nice try. But big defense for try because here we are on sixty nine percent right now. Uh, I don't think so. We can clear anything else. So this will be sixty nine. Nice try from Gohiel. Jesus, I'm not strong. That battle. Susie. Susie. <laughs> Susie. All right, coming in here. With the... Queen Charge Lalo. Alright, we are starting with the Queen. Interesting that we're going with the Warden. Okay. Still have Town Hall. Like, he's going for the big push with the heroes. Like, he has a log launcher set up. Now we are deploying log launcher. Queen has to fight the uh, King, sending the Headhunter to help her. They were seeking air mine and of course we pulled the CC. Right now we are using the wooden ability 
The queen kind of parting to the left side because we haven't opened the walls yet. I don't think so if she will be joining the kill squad. No, I was wrong. Okay, so queen quite smart here. Uh, joining the kill squad. We have panics on that multi inferno. Royal champion coming in from that left side here. So she will be clearing the scatter. Look, launcher keep going. Monolith is still up there, but uh, yet is coming out. Can we clear the town hall with the heroes? Royal champion OP. Now look at the multitask. We are sending the lava from the right side where we are using the skellies and also freezing and uh, raging there as well. Headhunters for the queen. Royal champion and the queen clearing the town hall here. One minute time is awesome. This is OP 3 star from Exorcist. What the plan? Wow, that was a very nice job. Like that queen and the arse is still alive. That's insane. Very nice attack from him. And it also was risky because he went with the heroes from the opposite side and he invests the warden with them. So for example, if he didn't open the wall and the heroes didn't clear that much, it could be even one star. So very nice job from him and tribe hitting the three star and that's mean that table turns and now try gaming has the lead because they're on 38.80% here, 33.80 for TWOP. Jeff, thank you very much for gifting another YouTube membership. Thank you very much. Thank you, thank you. All right. Sumit is in. Okay, he's going in here with the Super Archer Blim into the Lalo. Oh, hello. Aren't we that far away from the town hall? What am I missing here? We cloning. Did we clone any Super Archer behind that wall? It's feel that we are far away. Kind of worried here. Like he cleared the scatter shot. He had the wall breakers, but the wall breakers opened this wall. He he kind of wanted to open this wall so he can clear the town hall. And this is uh I don't know. We are in the trouble because town hall is up, single inferno monolith, everything is there, and we invest a lot of spells. So Sumit will try to recover in this attack. Like we are using the Electro Titan, the Electro Titan will be fighting these three Ice Golems right now. And the single Inferno almost went down, but now we have the Buddha guy fixing it. This will be tough, Lalo. Yeah, definitely not enough value with the uh, super archers. Using the baby dragon to funneling, so pushing the king and the queen going uh, towards the town hall here. That's our plan. Invisibility spell. Okay, town hall gonna get active, uh, invisible, sorry, for a few seconds. Yeah, I think so we can save it like hitting the save two star. I don't know. Down hole went down. Now we are Lalo Link. So we will be not fighting the sweeper. That is good news. But we have no uh, spells for the Lalo. We have only wooden ability. We are already targeting the uh, lava. Wooden. Wow, catching uh, the queen on the top. Can the queen clutch it and clear the monolith here? No, we are triggering. Actually, the headhunter is triggering the tornado trap. There, you can see that enemy queen is still up. Sadly, this one will be a hold for try gaming. Very nice try from Sumi, but we didn't land with the blim where we needed. We didn't touch the town hall, and there was way too many buildings left for the Lalo, especially when you have no other spells to protect this uh, loose. It will be, I think, so decent percent, uh, but hold for try. Okay, nice try, nice try. This one we will be finishing with the maybe 80? No, 79%. Very nice try. Alright, we'll go with the Queen Charge Lalo. Okay, I'm seeing Battle Drill here. How many matches are there? This one is the last one. Last one of today. I 
I'm good, Vague. I'm good. Can't complain. This so we have really amazing day today. Everything is looking good. Oh, ho, 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 that queen! <laughs> Whoa, that uh, she was chasing the royal champion. Get out of the invisibility spell and after hitting the bombs, good invisibility Oh, uh, and freeze there. Whoa. But sadly, she was forced to use the ability here. And now we will be sending the battle drill. Looks like the battle drill will go for the multi inferno. We open the wall here so the queen can go for the eagle. Battle drill putting the CC. So the CC going for the queen. Alright, battle drill for beauty mines, which are they are attacking single inferno. It should be enough. We need more yeti mines. Bull the guy is fixing it too fast. More yeti mines, single inferno is gone. Alright. Now queen fighting the enemy king. Already clearing the eagle. We have the king on the north side. We will be lulling here. We still are far away from activating the town hall, so we need some lava pups to help us. There is seeking and minus two of them. Lava Pups should be activating the town hall. There we go. Alright, rage over the town hall. Nice board and ability. Moose needs to start moving away. Now look at the wall breaker. Nicely done. The wall breaker opening the wall for the queen. Queen even triggering the tornado trap. Even better for his loose. But the enemy queen still being up there is issue. Royal champion stepping in to help. Queen is taking her sweet time until she going back for that multi inferno. Even the royal champion with the loose verge much much faster. Kronos very nice attack and try gaming now. Not gonna have only perts and lead but also gonna have the one star lead against TWOB. Wow. What a hit. Nicely done. Edges is live. <laughs> I just keep reading that one. Alright, Edges coming in here. Mm, okay, E Dragons against Exorcist. Tomorrow matches all will stay on YouTube, yes. Alright, Aegis is in here with the E-Dragons. Already used both the raid spells and the warden. We'll be blimping the town hall. Alright, freezing the monolith, raging the dragons there. Queen is log on the lava. We have one E-Dragon trying to help her. We clear the town hall. Alright, Eagle is still up there. Very low HP, but it's still there. Now, I'm a little bit worried here because we have still, look at these buildings, a ground expo, a scatter shot, a two multi infernos. It's gonna be a lot of damage going on there. We have three E Dragons on the north side. Many of them are very low HP. Look at this, that one is like almost dead. There's only one E Dragon left. Now the Queen already used the ability we have unicorn with her he's using the invisibility spell on her because she has to break the wall and before she will go for the scatter uh i don't know as going with the shell boom 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 dig is stunning that ground x bomb that's gonna work i don't think so that queen gonna give him that multi inferno so sadly it wasn't working she got one hit only the multi i think so it was much much worth it if he used the invisibility spell on rc because if he have the invisibility spell right now she could survive longer and maybe go the multi inferno down and this one, I don't know, like that E Dragon is still healthy. It just depends if we're gonna find any seeking air mine or anything because we have 55 seconds left here. Phoenix is up as well. Um, Cannon and the Mortal doesn't bother us. So let's see. Are there any traps around that multi inferno? That E Dragon, where are you going? Going for the. Um... All right. Camp. They're, they're flying so slowly, aren't they? Okay, it is about the traps here. E Dragon. Oh, Red Bomb. Okay. Still there. Panics on the Mortal. E Dragon keep hitting. 
One more hit. Multi Inferno going down and he clutch it with the Phoenix. AJ is hitting the three star and still keeping TWOB in this match. Regress is in. He will be coming in here with the kill squad, Lalo. All right, here we go. That queen maybe will be uh, going for the king. Okay, here we go. Now she's following the golems. That's good. Log launcher coming in here. We use some headhunters. Alright, pulling the CC, Imiti dropping the poison, the Royal Champion getting some hit on the multi Inferno, but now she got distracted by the CC. He's zapping that another Inferno here. RC will uh, go with the shield pretty soon. Right now she's fighting this uh, super minions. Queen is on the X Bow. Let's see what sh uh, RC shield can hit. Boom, 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 sniping the air defense. We were so, so close to, to uh, grab that single Inferno. Yetis are uh, going that way, so I think so we can get it. Yeti mines, there we go. Nicely done. We were fighting the same time also the enemy royal champion. Ice Hound, freezing everything around the town hall. We are deploying the rest of the loons, freezing one more time. We need these loons, come back for the town hall here. We are using the raid spell, warden ability being used. Now we are getting some split, so more loons are arriving. We still have Queen alive, which uh, she is still a uh, unicorn weaver, that's good, nice. And we have plenty of spells. You can nicely freezing uh, around that scatter shot. Uh, monolith, interesting base building, having monolith outside of the base. Okay. Oh, as I said, the loons are gone. No way, no way. Whoa, 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 whoa. Where the loons are? No. This one gonna be hold? Are you serious? What? I didn't even pay attention to this one. I saw plenty of loons and Drago. What? Stopping Rick from hitting the three star. 90% guys. And it actually even on stars, but tribe has still pets and lead. Drago is in. Final attack for TWOB. Right now, we're very close. We are tied on the stars, but tribe has the pets and lead here. Drago coming in here uh, with the blizzard Lalo. Alright, triggering the tornado trap behind the town hall. Super Wizard are moving closer to the town hall. Alright, pulling the CC. So we have to fight with the three ice golems. Electro Titan is helping the queen. Actually, you can see this uh, small CC disappear quickly with that uh, Electro Titan aura. dives let's see who's a king going in sniping the dacha tower with the loons queen following now the real champion going from the north side we are starting with the lalo already using the king ability we have two multi infernos Raid spell tower got activated. Invisibility spell on the queen. RC is on that multi. Actually, Diggy is standing there. Monolith is hitting poor Diggy. We cleared the multi inferno and the monolith. Queen now tanking the single inferno. He bent with the invisibility spell, but the queen ability was forced to use. RC with the shell. Boom, boom, boom. Sniping that second multi inferno. Drago looking good here. He still have over one minute. Three free spell and haste spell, so we can keep uh, alive these loons. Freezing around the scatter shot, hasting these loons, pushing them for that scatter. Freezing one more time. I keep helping. Let's 
Let's see. 50 seconds left. Clean up looking good. Plenty of minions behind. Now we are getting some split here. If the loons can tank that single inferno, the royal champion can survive. Come on, can she survive there? Ooh, red bomb, the loons going down. Single inferno still up there. 35 seconds left. Loons going for the uh, bomb tower. That's not big deal. Archer tower only can attack this loons. Getting against split. 25 seconds left for the last inferno here. And it is to restart from Drago. Very nice job from him, and that's mean TWOB putting the pressure here on Try Gaming because they are finishing this board with the 13 stars, but they don't have percent. So if Yo-Yo hit a three star, Try Gaming will take the victory. Everything is in the Yo-Yo hands right now. Yo yo heat will be deciding. <gasps> what a war. Pressure on yo yo. Exactly. Uh, he will be attacking Taya base. The world of battle. Uh, so did you notice he used the same trigger as the stars using the slammer instead of the uh, blim? No, I, ha I missed that, Maxim. That's a good point. Yo-Yo is live. Final attack for Tri Gaming. If Yo-Yo 3 star, it's victory for Tri. Anything less than triple, TWOB will take the win. Okay. So we use a zap spells. We are the monolith. x bow of course. Now looks like we are coming in here with the flame flinger from the 9 o'clock corner. And we are already deploying the queen from that south side. Using just a few troops to keep paneling and clearing the buildings around. Queen is on the eagle. First wall breaker is being used. Sending the headhunter and the freezing the enemy king. Our king is joining, helping the queen here. Now, another super wall breaker. So that could open this wall where is the multi. It looks like that board. Unicorn now has a lot of work to do. Queen is quite low health. King ability being used. Ice golem freezing everything around. We are pulling the three ice golem now. We have also still enemy queen there. He needs to kill these uh, buildings before the queen will be log on these ice golems. She's going here with the ability, dealing with the enemy queen, but the multi is still there. Multi still surviving. Our queen got froze again. This one was last uh, ice goal and queen very low health. So the phoenix will be trying to do some work, but being pushed by the sweeper here. Real champion on the scatter shot. Flame flinger trying to clear this scatter. I see with the shield. Boom, boom, boom. They're sniping that multi inferno. Nicely done with the shield. Lulling over the town hall. Haste. Hasting these loons, trying to go away. He lost a big group of the loons over the uh, that poison and the town hall. Royal champion still alive, helping with the monolith here. One minute left. We have only invisibility spell here. We still have to deal with the multi inferno, but we have troops from flame flinger. Can we clear these guys? All right, diggy. And the uh, Electro Owl with the minions clearing everything around. I don't know what kind of troops we will, we will have in the Flame Flinger. He's not popping that Flame Flinger. He's patient here. Now Yeti is going for the storage. I don't think so this will go in. We have actually just no heroes that no one can reach that multi inferno here. Like he's going with the loons for the Wizard Tower. We will need the Yeti Mines, but it's long... Uh, uh, road for them i don't think so they can make it because if the yeti might start hitting they will be taking the damage from the beans and not gonna land here and actually it is hold for tie up and try gaming will lose here whoa what the end of the war very nice try from yo-yo like look at this this yeti mines barely landing so so close 96% here 
I cannot believe Sumit, welcome in over on YouTube. Congratulations to you guys. That's insane. Taking the victory here. 13 to 12. Wow. What the end of this war. <laughs> big big shout out to Sumit over on YouTube. Nicely to see you here. Can't believe. I know many of you were voting for Tribe. I'm sure the Tribe was that favorite team here. And TW was underdog team. But look at them. 13 to 12. What comeback. And we have some crazy matches today. So give a sh uh, shout out to all teams which we are playing today. Again, we will be back tomorrow. I will see you tomorrow. And 2 p.m. UTC. We will be going with them. Navi versus Lotus Gaming, Chasmak GS versus Elite, TWOB versus Hydra by Hydras, and Try Gaming versus MS Esport. Amazing job! 